guys welcome to my channel Deb online today we are going to talk about this beautiful image magnifier glass system how you can create with the JavaScript it mostly is used like in an e-commerce business people using um, what kind of shirts what kind of watches or something they have in the picture they can see by clearly design colors everything like this so basically i already create uh, this so i will be not live coding with you guys but i can show you how i did this so let's talk about this so here is my files if you can see i'm not pretty sure uh, okay so let me a little bit build up. So this is index HTML file, basic structure. And here I just make one div with a class of image magnifier container. And here I give ID of my image and then image source. I alt I say anything and then size of image, how much size should be. After this, we're going to talk about some CSS. Here's a body. I give a margin zero, padding, display flex, justify content center, align center, height should be 100 VH, visual like height, and font family, background. Okay, so this is a box sizing, border box. Image magnifier, I just say position relative. Why I say position relative? Because when we move the cursor on the glass screen like, so it can show the relative. Here I define another extra class, image magnifier class, which we will be using in the JavaScript. When we go over there, I will be show you where I am implementing this. Position absolute to this. And then border, I give them three pixels solid black color. Border radius 50% cursor none and then just width and height after this the main thing we have to create a function with the JavaScript or with the jQuery you can say or JavaScript both are same like so we have to create a function and then implement in the another div which we never uh, describe in the index HTML file and so the function we call magnify and the magnify we give him two callbacks image id and zoom zoom effect zoom effect when we cursor move on the image so it can zoom the picture and show us the in which height width we want it so for this we need at least four to five variables the one is image glass width height and between size these four variables we have to create a function with these four variables so first of all image image basically the function of this image property so image is equal to document dot get element id from the image id image id means it's a created image the every image have a different kind of id on the several parts so they we give them the id by the image id image is equal to by this id the callback function and then we create a magnifier glass so now we need to create a glass the second variable glass glass we seek document dot create element so we have to create one another element which is called div so we going to make another div so we equal glass variable to the div and then we give him some attributes attributes mean like you give him some classes so we set attributes class name like name of attribute is class and this image magnifier glass which we already style in the CSS image magnifier glass here so we give him glass to this div. So here we implement the glass. And if you see here, so this is basically the glass, the round black um, border with it. 
after this, what we have to do, we need to take image and then his parent element, that's a function of JavaScript and then we're going to insert before this image, we have to insert this glass on it and the glass have a property of image. Now we need to style the background of the glass, so glass.style.background what should be the background of the glass, what we can see in the glass so we see take the URL of the URL and then image whatever the image is and then the image source you know the image property and the image property have a source the dot image dot source so they can come here so this is the image we in which we are going to show in the glass second we say background repeat so we never say no repeat and then we have given style background size so we say image dot width so whatever the image width if you can see here image dot width 700 pixel we say into zoom from where came the zoom zoom is here when we define in the second callback we will be later discuss with it plus pixel then plus image height and zoom into zoom and then pixel after this we go by between okay, bw is basically between so we say between is equal to 3 3 pixel or 300 pixel you can see width so we say glass dot offset width divided by 2 height is offset divided by 2 now we need to create a function when we mouse move on the image so the glass what over the glass images come so here we say glass we can add we add the event listener on this which is called mouse move and name it move magnifier the same event listener we give to the image also here this code we going to define for the touch screen people when the they have a no keyboard type or not mouse word just have a touch so then when they can touch so we here also add event listener for the touch move now we need to this event listener we have to functionalize how it's gonna be works so we say functional function move magnifier event we give him event e is event so var position what is gonna be position position we create three variable position x and y so first of all we say event so event we say prevent default like a default whatever event from the javascript position we equal the position the cursor position what the get, get the cursor position means in the mouse over position event x we say position dot x so whatever the position of the mouse x value if you uh, never know about the x value like here uh, and x and y like this height and width you can say here and y we say position dot y so whatever the position of y and whatever the position of x now we need to prevent the magnifier glass from being positioned outside the image so what will be the outside of the image with the actual image and the outside image so here we define when it's greater than the width so less uh, so create the less width of the zoom divided by zoom which is we define also here so the zoom effect the zoom effect in between is like a three here is a width we define x is equal to image dot width and then minus zoom same like less than the y if you can see here and the height zoom divided by height object property now we need to define uh, set the position of the magnifier glass so set the position glass dot style dot left style x minus width the x position basically position dot x is equal to plus pixel and then the top side y minus height and pixel
now we need to display the magnifier glass what we can see on it so we say glass that style that background position took the background position and x size multiply by zoom and then we say minus from width plus between size per plus pixel like three pixel the same we say y into zoom and then minus height which is h h you can say height y minus h where we define here glass dot offset height divided by two offset and the width is offset width two we going to describe here h plus between plus pixel now we have to create another function which is the get cursor position we need to get the cursor position so we say variable a a, a and a, a and then we say x is equal to 0 and y is equal to 0 e is equal to e or you can say window dot event so event or window dot event the same thing get the x and y position of the image so we say a is equal to image dot get bounding client react whenever client move from the cursor move the x and y position so we here say calculate the cursor x and y and coordinate relative to image now we say x is equal to event dot page x size so a dot left and a dot top now any page scrolling we also define with the page scrolling page x offset and page y offset with the page open and at the end we return the value x is equal to the x value is x and y value is y so this our function of magnify which is work with the html here here we say magnify my image into three times i hope you guys like this video if you have any question please comments below i hope i can answer you very well with it thank you have a good day